English Summer National Day. Seamus O'Neill is about to dispatch the runners in the first. They're coming into line. And they're off. Racing for the Federation of Small Businesses Novices Hurdle. Over two miles. Ten flights of hurdles to cross as they approach the first. Abbey Express in the black and white checks. And Saga Rich, along with Handsome Chap, who sweated freely, are amongst the leaders. Sam Bulando jumped it prominently, racing very keenly after jumping the first flight. I can sing a rainbow. Another who sweated freely is chasing the leading quartet, but it's Abbey Express with the overall lead heading on towards the second flight. About three lengths clear at this obstacle from Saga Rich, Handsome Chap, Sam Bulando. One or two indifferent jumps in behind. Paris Hall is well out the back in the early stages as they come on towards the next flight of hurdles charlie green occupying the last position gozome is also towards the rear abbey express just with a narrow lead at the third hurdle where viable made a mistake and paris hall hit it very hard as well and went away to the right so coming on towards flight number four abbey express from saga rich not much between the front two. Sam Bulando's jumped up into third place in front of Handsome Chap. They're being followed by Jelly Tot, and then comes Viable. They're followed by I Can Sing a Rainbow. Claudia is behind those, racing in front of Gozome. And it's Rivers Run Free, and the last pair are Charlie Green and finally Paris Hall. That's the roll call as they swing left-handed to race out of the home straight. A full circuit of the race course ahead of them. And they still have six more obstacles to jump. Abbey Express has made all the running to this point. He's being followed by the two greys. Saga Rich on the outside of Sam Bulando. They're chased by Handsome Chap. Viable moving closer to the leaders. Then comes Jelly Tot up the inside of I Can Sing a Rainbow. As they go over the fifth, Abbey Express on the inside of Narrow Leader. Handsome Chap made a mistake and gets reminders at flight number five. So they're on their way towards the middle flight on the far side. Paris Hall is tailing off despite plenty of encouragement from the saddle. The other 11 are still covered by about a dozen lengths as Sargarich now goes up to join issue with Abbey Express coming to flight number six. Odds on favourite Sam Bulando jumped it third as Sargarich took up the running there. Viable's running fourth now as they breast the rise in the back straight. I can sing a rainbow is fifth and those five have gone clear of Jelly Top, the fading handsome chap, and then Claudia, who's picking up positions as they jump the last on the far side, which was four from the finish. The weakening handsome chap made his second mistake of the race, which has seen him drop right to the back of the field as Saga Rich leads Sam Bulando on the descent out of the back straight. Viable racing two lengths behind them in third. They've quickly gone clear from the fading early leader, Abbey Express. I can sing a rainbow has been outpaced, and it only concerns three of them as they swing into the home straight. Saga Rich being driven along, but Sam Thomas is sat motionless on board Sam Bulando. As they go over the third last, they touch down together, but the odds-on favourite is travelling much the better. Gina Andrews is now coming with a run on board Viable, and she's about to take second place behind the new leader, Sam Bulando, as they come to jump two from home. Sam Bulando over the second last, a couple of lengths in front of the driven along Viable. Saga Rich is held in third. Abbey Express is clinging on to a moderate fourth as they run towards the final flight of hurdle. Sam Bulando is having to be shaken up, but he still holds a two-length lead. Comes to the last and jumped it well. Viable in honest pursuit. He's running three lengths down in second. They've drawn well clear of Saga Rich. It's Sam Bulando having to be ridden out by Sam Thomas as Viable's effort still being sustained, but going up towards the line, Sam Bulando wins comfortably enough by two and a half lengths. Second place has gone to Viable. Saga Rich finished 12 lengths back in third. And Claudia was flying at the finish, running on very strongly into fourth. Well, there you go. The odds on favourite obliges, but not without a little scare or two. Viable giving this one a real run for its money.